Beautiful Seattle, Washington, and baseball's crown jewel of the Pacific Northwest as we come to you tonight from Seattle and T-Mobile Park where the Seattle Mariners host the Chicago Cubs on Friday Night Baseball on Apple TV Plus. Bryce Miller. Absolutely. He was outstanding against the Milwaukee Brewers the last time out, going seven scoreless and just giving up three hits and seven Ks. So expect a high volume of fastball and that nasty split finger, but should have got a good matchup. As Bryce Miller's first pitch to Ian Happ is hit high in the air and shallow in right field as Mitch Hanniger back with the Mariners makes the catch. Suzuki has been hammering the baseball dating back to last August. He has really turned into one of the premier hitters right now in the National League and he's off to a good start to this season. In behind second base off to his left J.P. Crawford calling for it right at the cut of the grass he's there reaches up and makes a two handed catch and that's out number two and the batter is Cody Bellinger. Here's ball four so Miller walks Bellinger and the Cubs have their first base runner. Morrell has been a dynamite spark plug for the Cubs offense. He strikes out on a 2 2 fastball. Bryce Miller challenging Morrell and beating him. J.P. Crawford will lead things off against the young left hander Jordan Wicks. It's it hard on the ground, but right out of Gold Glover, Nico Horner makes the play. Julio still looking for that first home run of the season. He hits this one well towards center field. Pretty deep, but Bellinger has room. And Rodriguez off the end of his bat a bit, flies out. Ty France, the batter, swing and a miss by Ty France. There was the changeup for Wicks, who gets his first strikeout of the night. A 1 2 3, bottom of the first. Hanniger, the right fielder, will make an easy catch, and that's out number one. Scoreless ball game, second inning, and the batter, Michael Bush. That ball hit hard, but it's caught. Back footed leap by Ty France to make the catch on a liner off the bat of Bush. Get up, get on up. I saw, a hops. I saw a little hops over there. Everybody feeling good. A little looper towards short. It gets over Crawford, and Horner has a base hit with two outs here in the second. Mike Tuckman, the batter. A looper toward the left field line. Dylan Moore is there to win the inning. Here come the Mariners. Two on with nobody out here in the bottom of the second. Let's see Mitch Garver get a piece of that action, too. There's ball four, so Jordan Wicks in some serious trouble. Two hits and a walk to load the bases. Here's Cal Raleigh, and it seems like any time the Mariners need a big hit, it's Raleigh there to deliver one. Swing and a miss. He did double up, and Jordan Wicks strikes out Cal Raleigh. See, this is a situation where you have to be able to cash in. Suzuki has it in right field, and the Mariners will not challenge the arm of Suzuki, who gets it in. So Wicks has rebounded with back-to-back -back outs, and the bases are still loaded. Mariners just averaging around three runs per game so far, and here's a golden chance. It's the number nine batter, Luis Urias. Oh they hit him. Goodness. Jordan Wicks hits Urias with a pitch. And the Mariners are gifted a run with two outs. He's done well in his career with the bases loaded. And he grounds this one to third. It is handled by Morrell. Look to second base. But fires it to first to retire Crawford. Jordan Wicks minimizes the damage, but he does give up a two out run. Jan Gomes first up here in the third inning. You haven't seen my fastball yet. <laughs> well, Jan Gomes saw three of them. Yeah. Struck out on three pitches. Half flied out to right field his first time. Ian Happ with a chopper. Good pick by Urias at third. And he gets Happ. So here's Suzuki who popped out to short his first time. Suzuki hits it hard and right as it passed France in the right field. Knocked the other way for Seiya Suzuki with two outs here in the third. Ellinger hits one hard towards center field, but it hangs up. Rodriguez right there. And that ends the inning. Here in the bottom of the third, Julio Rodriguez leads off against Jordan Wicks. Oh, Rodriguez. Came up empty there. Though maybe he got a piece, but he didn't strike three. So Jordan Wicks gets him to bite on that changeup again. Topper toward third and backhand Morrell can't get the throw off. Infield hit for Ty France. There's a ground ball to the left side. Swanson has that to Horner for one over to first. Not in time. The Cubs trying to turn two on the ball deep in the hole. It's short. Swanson goes out. Ian Happ comes in, and it's Happ to retire Polanco to end the third. Morrell with a fly ball to right as Mitch Hanniger waits for it and there's one away here in the fourth. Swung on line drive into left field here comes Demo. Runs it down comes straight in two out. Michael Bush hooks one toward the right field corner that's a base hit. Bush ends up at second base with a two out double the first extra base hit tonight. Fly ball to right hit fairly well but Hanniger is there. And Bryce Miller works around a two out double still a one nothing game in Seattle. So Mitch Garver twice worked walks. 
Opportunity for Cal Raleigh. Mitch Garver advances to second base on a wild pitch. Swing and miss. Raleigh fights on the changeup again, and Jordan Wicks has his fourth strikeout. Running away with a fastball miss. Walked it. Third walk, second this inning. Two on, one out for Arias. He swings and misses here as Wicks blows the fastball by him. The fifth strikeout for Wicks. That just missed. And instead, it's his third walk of the inning. He has walked the bases loaded to bring up Julio Rodriguez. Rodriguez has only had one extra base hit so far. But he lines this ball toward right center. Bellinger comes in, slides and knocks it down. Two run score and a base hit for Julio Rodriguez as the Mariners take a 3 0 lead. He's tied trying to get some more. And now Ty France slaps one the other way for an RBI base hit. And the Mariners break through with two outs in the fourth against Jordan Wicks. There's a swing and a miss to get out of the inning that give the Mariners some extra runs. Well, Ian Happ draws a walk with two outs as Miller was getting that inside corner except for that last pitch. So Happ is aboard to bring up Suzuki. It's a soft bouncer. There to make the play at second base is Jorge Polanco and Bryce Miller continues to cruise. So the leadoff man on another walk this time Mitch Garver is the batter he's walked twice but he puts one in play here as a fly ball heads toward right center Suzuki calls for it and makes the catch and Cal is seeing nothing but soft stuff off speed pitches Smiley has the runner caught throw to second base it is in time as Polanco gets caught stealing on Drew Smiley pickoff attempt. Strikeout for Smiley ends the fifth. Still a 4 nothing game in Seattle. One, two, three, go the Cubs in the sixth. Three up, three down. We go to the bottom of the sixth inning. It remains Mariners four, Cubs nothing. Dylan flied out the right, walked and scored in the fourth inning when the Mariners sent eight men to the plate. Fly ball looping toward the left field line. Long run Swanson and Happ, and it's Ian Happ with a sliding catch. Dansby gave Happ a look like I'm not going to be able to get there. That's your ball. And Hap made that catch and slide look very easy. So two up, two down for Drew Smiley here in the sixth inning as another gold glove winner steps up to the plate, J.P. Crawford. Crawford with a ground ball up the middle. It's Horner with a backhand pick. And an off oh, throw that is dropped no. by Michael Bush. It should have ended the inning as Horner made a great play, but Bush couldn't hang on to the baseball. Swing and a miss. Rodriguez unable to make any contact there as Drew Smiley gets a strikeout. Second time Rodriguez has punched out tonight. Scott Service is making his way toward the mound and that will likely be that for Bryce Miller who was awfully sharp tonight at exactly 100 pitches in six and a third innings. Crowd already revving up. Miller disappointed that he just walked Horner. But Bryce Miller gets a big applause here at T-Mobile Park for a job well done. Yeah, uh -oh. Thornton spikes a pickoff attempt and Horner takes second base on an air. So that run would be charged to Miller if it's scored. Popped up. Urias chases coming in. A catch. What a play by Luis Urias. Bryce Miller appreciating the defensive support. Cubs trying to mount a late comeback. Breaking ball hit to the left side. Gloved by Urias. Takes his time. Throws over his time. Got him. No, 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 no. Now they're going to say Ty dropped the ball. And that run, running hard all the way, was Horner. And he scored on what looked like it was a routine play. I think with Stanek, he has very good stuff. One out, Michael Bush, the batter here in the ninth inning. There's a long fly ball from Michael Bush, and the Cubs aren't done yet. A long home run to make it a 4-2 to two ball game. Now the Cubs are down to their last chance. Soft bouncer. Polanco has it. The Seattle Mariners take game one of this series from the Chicago Cubs. Julio Rodriguez had the big hit, a two-out, two-run single in the fourth, and the Mariners win it four to two.